Hello, I'm Don McGann. I am here to talk to you about skeletal anchorage. And first, uh, the benefits are going to be quite obvious to you as you look through the cases. Not only can you use bands, brackets, and wires, but attached to those, you add different dimensions to where you can move the teeth and the arches. You can dislize entire upper arches. You can move them up or down, controlling the vertical. And this is a fantastic benefit that we have never had in our, in our toolbox before. All of these are done without patient compliance. In other words, you have control of where the teeth are going to go, and you can move the teeth to places that previously we couldn't do at all. You're going to be doing the impossible. In class, in seminar 9 and 10, we're going to be doing exercises that are going to show you just how easy it is for you to learn skeletal anchorage. Provide the services yourself, or you could refer to a surgeon for those cases that you don't want to do. So, to help you on that, we have a skull that you will be having and on that session three, you'll be putting brackets on there. When we get to nine and ten, you have several locations where we're going to have you place bone plates. You would have coils extended from that bone plate, which is supporting the force that can, ap that can apply forces to the teeth that previously was impossible. For instance, this one, the piriform rim. You can now apply a force going straight up on the anterior teeth, correcting gingival display even on adult patients or for a mechanical advantage in deep bite cases. This will be the number two one that you use after you know all of these locations. Then we got the zygomatic, zygomatic buttress. This is the number one location because in orthodontics, bands, brackets, and wires, you can't pull up and back. It just doesn't happen. So now you've got control that you have never been able to do before. The services that you can offer with just a few little screws and bone plates and coils becomes worth to them two, three times what the orthodontic fee would be. So who's going to learn this? All POS students are going to learn easy skeletal anchorage in the future. Each one of you, in order to do the skull like I described, and in your practice, you need to have a skeletal anchorage kit. This kit has been specifically made for you so that you can do this easily and effectively. We have a screwdriver. The block is where you store all your screws, and that's where you pick up your screws. You have to learn the materials, learn how they're used, feel how they're used, and the skull is actually quite, quite similar to the patient itself. Look at the anatomy. Make sure you know where you're placing these and where the bone is, where the screws are supposed to be hooked, hooked into, where the coils are supposed to be, and how much force. You have to feel all these things and then you can go do it on a patient. Today it is predictable. For you it is predictable. You know exactly where, you know exactly how much force for each tooth movement and learn how to do this because I'm telling you there's some of them are so easy. By the time you picked up the phone you'd have it done. You're going to be doing the impossible.